Butter took his plea okay. agreement to tell on us. My other rappy, a female, she took 12 years, 85, for attempted murder. I was the last one. Who the fuck I'm gonna tell on? I ain't believe it till my, till my mama told me, man. I ain't believe that shit. Cause when we came in, he was trying to blame it on the girl that's our co-defendant. I was believing him all along, cause it's supposed to be my little shorty. It's my, you know what I'm saying? I'm take care of shorty, man. Everybody know this. I'm taking his word, and the whole time I'm in the room thinking another motherfucker telling it, and his goofy ass telling. I was finna beat his okay. ass on bro. He told the police on me. I got he told that the paperwork police on too. You. Yeah, I got that paperwork too. Yo, y'all know what it is, y'all know what it ain't I'm back with another one and I'm finna drop one more Me and Batman Kevin have been talking behind the scenes I got one more video coming for the day And I'ma take a break But for now, this is what I meant when I said A lot of stuff finna be unraveled when Lil J come home I know y'all been watching my past few videos I've been reading the comments, some of them This dude was like, man, what do you mean by this? What do you mean by that? This is what I mean by things have to get addressed When things get addressed, that means whoever's in the wrong can no longer lie I don't care about who wrong, I don't care about who right, I just care about the facts because everybody gonna lie on each other. Lil J probably lying about a lot of stuff, Butter probably lying about a lot of stuff, but the facts gonna come out. Everybody has their own truth, but you heard what Lil J say, he has paperwork on Butter snitching on him. So now, but since Lil J just said, Lil Butter told the police Jay was finna whoop him. You got the paperwork, you just let the world know, me included, which I'm in the world, that you got paperwork. Now you have to release it. It shouldn't be no more... He, him like you know what I mean like he said she said uh I'll talk to people close to butter camp I'm not gonna say who I talk to they got paperwork they said when time is ready they're gonna release it they just let Lil J do his welcome home party right now and other stuff like this I've been hearing so much stuff bro and I'm not the type of blogger who gonna get on here and tell y'all what I've been hearing behind the scenes but just know I've been talking to people and the feel is mutual on both sides I feel like butter really honestly Got some valid points that he's gonna let the world know really soon, and right now it's just Lil J turn. It's he, our eyes on him. He the cloud lord. He fresh home. Everybody want to hear his side of the story. And I, I just watched the interview. I don't know. My girl called me because I love my girl. I love my family, bro. People keep me on my toes. Like I, it's just crazy how my family interested in my blogging life. They will call me up. My girl called me like, did you hear Lil J said? But a snitch for Italian beef in the pop. I'm damn merch. Who out the band? Who out the band? But then, you know, when I'll be talking to people who are close to the camp, I'm, I'm hearing a lot of stuff about how Lil J was checked in the PC, about the Geechee rumors, and there's a gay dude named Snowball. Snowball finna come out and tell they side of the story. It's not gonna be on my channel. Uh, you know what I mean? But I don't know if you're watching this, Lil J. Just do these words right here mean something to you, bro? Jaylani and Snowball. I don't know what's true or I don't know what's not. But them, them two names, I'm gonna just put out there, Lil J. If you're watching this and you, you feel some type of way, you know, just your reaction to probably just answer that question for me. But on a serious note, if Butter was finna fight Lil J and he told, that's flawed. I remember me and my cousin, the one I fought who poured out my drills before, and I said I should have popped him and y'all was talking crazy. Um, his mama pressed charges because my, there's a lot of stuff going on behind that. He busted my windows, and I was finna whoop his ass. Before we went in the courthouse, and you know what he did? He got escorted through the side door, him and his mama. So that's flawed. That's really flawed if you did something like that. But like I say, truth going to be truth, and facts going to be facts. I don't want to hear nobody truth. I just want to see the facts, and the facts will come out sooner or later. Get in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think below. I'm gone.